Hi. Uh, it's Thursday, which is a little cilantro there, which is good news, right? Um, I have Friday, Saturday, Sunday to get through, basically. Um, I am, I had a big eating day today, which I haven't had in a while. Like today, I actually had, um, I'm having a hard time like looking at the right place. Okay. I don't know. It's, it's weird. It's like I need a target or something. Okay. Um, I ate like two full meals today, which for me is really strange lately. I haven't had full meals. So, um, that was a little weird, but, um, I figured I would do it today and then hopefully, um, I was two pounds above the goal weight, which I need to hit Monday at 1.30 <laughs> today, this morning. So my hope is that I will, um, you know, not eat between now and then liquids basically. Um, and that should be good. I ate a lot today though for me. Um, it was kind of weird. It was kind of like, I don't know. It's just weird because I, I love eating so much and I've really managed to not eat. So I'm pretty proud of myself for that. So to have two full meals is like, what? Um, one of the things I've been doing, I've had to do for homework for my next appointment is to come up with my uh, food plan for the phase three diet, which is the blenderized pureed phase. Uh, and so we had to actually do a liquid diet three days. That sucked. I did it. And, um... And so then I have to write down my plan for the blenderized phase. Um, and it says plan for a cup of food at a time. And um, it's like solids, liquids, solids, liquids, alternating. Of course, you can't have liquids with solids, as we know, once you've had the uh, sleeve. So I've put things like egg beaters um, with a little cheese, low fat cheese. Um, Refried beans. I don't know if that's um, pushing it, but I guess we'll see. Baby food in a fruit. Um, I have looked at the baby food aisle in the grocery store multiple times, and I'm kind of like, chicken, pulverized chicken. I'm just not sure I'm going to be able to do that. So, and I know I can do it myself. I would obviously do it myself, but still, I don't know. Uh, I'm wondering if the tuna. You know, because I have tuna. I don't love tuna, but I, I'm sure I'll like it then. Just out of desperation. But I'm wondering if the tuna can just be really super mashed. And then you're like, fine. I don't know. Just the, putting it in the blender makes me want to die. <laughs> um, yogurt. Uh, of course, Premier Proteins. And I'm not sure if I'm supposed to put that there or not. She might get, my dietitian might be like, no. Uh, I was thinking those powdered mashed potato cups, you know, like this big and just make, it's not, the numbers aren't, I mean, it's not a great food, I don't think, but it's not horrifically bad in fat or calories. So I thought if I mix that with some protein powder, unflavored, um, maybe be okay. Uh, of course, blenderized soup. I have mashed banana, which I don't like, but again, it's food. And I have to come up with one more day. I don't think I did a great job on this, but um, I'm not sure. It's just like, it's like you just have to kind of plan. And I, my sense is I'm actually just going to really be eating or having um, protein shakes. I mean, what I've heard from people who've had it that I know is like, you're just not even going to eat anything. Um, the suggestions, cream of wheat. <laughs> um, mashed potato, tuna fish, blended soup, sugar-free pudding. Um, yeah. So I just want to be sure I get my protein in. And so I got to come up with the rest of that. Um, the other kind of update is that I haven't been great about, um, I've been kind of like in a fog just because the eating has been really it's just stressful like I just um 
I just, I struggle so mightily with my hunger and with my stress eating and emotional eating and all the eating. I love all the eating. So I've um, not been logging on my fitness pal. And it's been okay because it's not like I'm mindlessly eating. I'm really not eating much at all, but I just, I can't bear. I just feel like I just don't want to think about food. So I'm... I'm kind of struggling to just to not log it and I don't know it's not great because it's it's a habit I need to get I need to be in I know it works so I have been weighing myself though which is a huge deal for me I should probably do a video maybe tomorrow I'll talk about that about my um, scale neuroses because um, I definitely have a thing about the scale so I don't know what it is it's just I can't I hate to see the number it's a big number um, and one of the things I'm really looking forward to is not being afraid to have my picture taken because right now I hate it. <laughs> Even though I can see that I've lost like 15 pounds, right, since my highest this time. I'm sure I've been higher, but I know I have and I know things are fitting better and I feel better, but I still, I'm, I'm very heavy and so it's just... Um, you know, somebody took pic I thought I looked so cute yesterday, and that's the other thing. It's like, mentally, it's like I'm, I have body image, reverse body image issues. I think I look okay. <laughs> and, um, somebody took a picture of me last night, and I was like, oh. I edited myself out, and they were yelling. I'm like, I, I hate it. I don't want to see it. So, I'm kind of looking forward to not being a spaz about that anymore. But... Okay, I'm gonna wrap this up. I am going to talk to you tomorrow. I've got a big weekend ahead of trying to get through. I'm gonna do it, okay.